everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the Windows 11 Ethernet adapter is not working. First of all, before diving into any solutions, you have to make sure of the following things. Check if the Ethernet cable is connected properly. Sometimes it might be unplugged from the router or it's simply broken, so always make sure of that. You can also restart the modem or router. There's always a switch behind the router, so make sure to toggle the switch on and off to turn off the router. Then turn it back on and see if it works. Otherwise, if there's no switch, you can just unplug it from the electrical outlet and plug it back in after a few seconds. And lastly, you can also restart your Windows 11 PC. As simple as it may sound, it usually fixes a lot of problems. So press the Windows button and then select the power icon and select the restart option. The first solution to take in consideration is to check if the Ethernet adapter is enabled. To do this, press the Windows button and then simply type ncpa.cpl and select it from the search results. In here, make sure to check if the Ethernet adapter is grayed out, and if it's grayed out, it means you have to manually enable it. To do this, right-click the Ethernet adapter and select the Enable option. In my case, it's disabled because I'm using Wi-Fi connections. You can also update or reinstall the Ethernet driver. To do this, just right-click the Windows button, then select Device Manager from the list of options. Now you have to expand the network adapters, then right-click the problematic Ethernet adapter and select the Properties option. Now go to the Driver tab, and in here you will see that you have plenty of options, but we will focus on the Update Driver button and the Uninstall Device button. If you click the Update Driver button, you will see that you have multiple options. In here you can just search automatically for drivers and Windows will find the best driver possible for your adapter. Otherwise, if you choose to uninstall the device, you can just click on the Uninstall Device button and Windows will uninstall the driver and once you restart your PC, it will reinstall it back again. Another useful solution is to run the Network Adapter Troubleshooter. To do this, press the Windows button and then select the Settings icon and in here make sure to select System on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find and select the Troubleshoot section. Now click on Other Troubleshooters and then in here you have to scroll down until you find the Network Adapter Troubleshooter and simply select the Run button. In here you have to select the Network Adapter to diagnose, so click on Ethernet and then press on Next. Now Windows will find any potential issues and fix them if possible. Another great solution is to update Windows 11. To do this, press the Windows button and simply type Update and then select the Check for Updates option from the search results. In the Windows Update portal, you have to select the Check for Updates blue button and now you just have to wait until Windows will find any possible updates and install them if that's the case. And lastly, another useful solution is to reset network settings. To do this, press the Windows button and then select the Settings icon and in here, on the left pane, make sure to select the Network and Internet option and then on the right side, scroll down until you find Advanced Network Settings. Now you can just scroll down again and select the Network Reset option and lastly, just press on the Reset Now button to reset the network. And that's it. Plenty of options to consider in the long run. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.